yes yeah, it's, it's it's not something i really want to just dive right into it's it's too much what's what's this vegan teacher shit i've been wanting to make a video on her so i'm gonna make a video on vegan teacher because she she just shows up all the time all right i'm gonna i'm gonna look at vegan teacher okay i'm gonna show i'm gonna look at vegan teacher and we'll make a video out of it okay who the fuck is she uh, i've already seen me canyon yeah what is this vegan teacher twenty thousand subscribers okay Oh, she's a TikToker, right? She's a TikToker? Cool, okay. So what does she do? Bro, she's just fucking smart, okay? She just calls out channels bigger, and then she just she just calls out bigger channels, and that's what it is. She just calls out bigger fucking channels, and then the bigger channels respond, and then she gets her fucking metrics. You people cave way too hard into this. All right, what are we doing? We have COVID? Did she write that to get by the algorithm? She named her pet. Oh YouTubers. my fucking god. Hello students. Hello new followers. I'm just here at home and I wanted to let you see our little roommate whose name is COVID. Well, of course, first of all, you know Bella. Bella has been vegan since August 2017. Will you make your dog vegan? Oh, dude, dude, what the fuck? What the fuck? You can't make a dog fucking vegan, you dumbasses! Dogs eat meat. They don't eat fucking. I'm, I fuck. I fucking hate this shit, dude. I fucking hate these pet owners. Fucking it. We turned our dog vegan. We turned our dog vegan. Okay, sure. That's. And I'm gonna take her out for a walk after this video. She's just waiting. She's like, give me meat. Look at her nails. She hasn't had them cut since the beginning of COVID. And um, so this is where I compose my songs. There's my little piano there, you could see. And as you could see here in Canada. It's... Oh, she's Canadian? God bless, dude. The mouse goes in the back. Okay, they wander in there because they want to get to the peanut butter, which they smell because they have these holes here. And then they get in there and then they're stuck in there until you release them. Um, so what, sorry, I'm trying to do this with my hand. Okay, that's kind of cool, the humane mouse traps. Like, you capture them and you release them in the wild. Yeah. I I'm, I fuck with that. That's cool. Yum. Okay, but like, show me COVID. I just want to see the fucking... I want to see your, your thing. No, I've never taken care of I thought of she had, like, a Rube Goldberg, mach a Goldberg machine box. for a second. I was like, just... what? Show me COVID! Oh, there's... Co oh, my God. Holy shit. COVID is scared. Oh, my fucking God. <laughs> no, 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 no. Thank you, Keisha Eakins. You fucking love me? Well, I love you too. How do you feel about the proposed code of conduct change? That happened months ago, dude. Fuck that. What headset do I use? My Arctic Seven's broke, so uh, I went to the. I, I was at, I was at the store, right? And like, usually I'm like one of those guys that won't spend money. My brother forced me to buy one of these like Arctis Nines, which have like the replaceable batteries. Smartest fucking decision in my life, dude. The batteries on my Arctis Sevens, whoo, they fucking died. They die like e after five minutes. Okay, you could like power them on. They'd be like, huh? You want to use this wirelessly? No. That that mouse is scared shitless, dude. Yes, I did. Oh, it's like, it's not me. even alive. What? Is it for me? That hamster's <laughs> not even alive. All right, so let's put it here. That hamster's scared. What the hell do you do? <laughs> He's like, no. Don't worry, no, don't give me the tofu. No, don't give me tofu, please. No tofu. Yeah, Pyrocynical's back. Yeah, I mean, he, you know... Didn't he clear himself pretty well? There we go. Why the fuck and would you name it COVID? Get some of her food here. So today I have just a little piece of bread. And this is a little piece of banana. So you bought a... You, you, you adopted an animal. Alright, you adopted an animal and you, and you named it after a fucking you, you roughly named it after what is one of the fucking greatest uh life events of human history for the fucking clickbait god damn all right let's go down what 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 do we got over here the vegan teacher sings to eating animals is wrong trisha paytas oh man dude i swear to god if 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 i <laughs> You know, you know how much I hate using Twitter? You can block Twitter page paid us all you want, but you're still going to see her squirting. Your, her pussy squirting on Twitter. I've seen it so much, man. 
you know Critical's video got recommended to me the other day with literally like Trisha Paytas making out with a fucking uh, alien like I just I couldn't dude I couldn't um nothing towards Trisha Paytas I'm sure she's a very nice person I just don't want to see her pussy squirting at me on Twitter it's too much animals is wrong Trisha Paytas hurting animals is wrong Trisha Paytas share this song and why <laughs> Why the fuck you, why the ukulele? <laughs> what the fuck is the point of that? What the fuck, what's the point of the ukulele? It's like, it's like, I can, I can, I can sing. All right, uh, we'll watch the Tommy in it one. I just want to see what she does to Trisha Paytas. Okay. I sang that song and I put it on TikTok and it has over 21 million views. Yeah, because it's all bought a Chinese algorithm views. Now, the reason I want to tell you about it, Trisha, is because I saw a video recently of you eating McDonald's in your car with, I guess, your boyfriend, your mom, and maybe it was your sister. I don't know. Now, on what the f Wait a minute. Does it, this almost sounds like it's it's like, is was that so evil? Like, listen, man, I, I'm is that is that such an evil thing? Trisha, I saw you eating a fucking McDonald's burger in your car, bitch. All right, you do you do realize that is that is quite the illegal, right? Like you do realize that that's that's quite wrong, uh, that's quite haram, by the way. All right, eating McDonald's, she's she's about to like she's about to like fucking she's about to call the police off, dude. Honestly, I don't really know you. I okay. just saw you flash on my TikTok, but Damn. I saw a few things and a few things alarm me. Now, before I became a school teacher, I was working as a registered nurse for twenty five years. That was really d okay. Uh, I was looking sure. at you and what you're eating, and to be honest with you, I think you already know that the way you're eating is not healthy. But that's not my concern right now. Wow, she just called her fat as fuck, didn't she? Wow, that is the rudest shit I've ever heard. Like she didn't outright say it, but she's like, Trisha, you know I see you eat those hamburgers, and bitch, I think you already fucking know there's something wrong. All right. <laughs> <laughs> oh my fucking god she's like legitimately what a bitch she's like yeah trisha i know you get i know you need the butter between the fucking door handles all right i, I, know, I know you get stuck in the door you know if you were vegan wouldn't be getting stuck in no motherfucking doors all right trisha did you get the double door installed in your mansion we know that wasn't just for the resale value let's be fucking real wow that that's like that's like the night that's like the most demonetization friendly way of saying hey fat ass. <laughs> what the fuck, dude? Damn, Trisha Paytas, you gotta clap back. She's calling you out, shit. My concern is the animals and what you are promoting on your channel. I want you to be vegan from now on, Trisha. Listen, you know the life that you're living right now. All this fame and all this free stuff that you get. It's shallow. It's just God, Trisha, all this Trisha, I know deep down when you're sitting in your Lamborghini in your seven figure mansion, eating your fucking meat, eating your foie gras, eating your filet mignon that, you know, it's really fucking shallow. You know, there's something I'm going to tell you guys about fucking money. You know what I mean? This is actually a scary video. I don't even fucking care. This is a creepy YouTube video. This is, in my opinion, that's what it is. <laughs> I'll be honest with you, dude. I don't think Trish cares too much. <laughs> uh, <laughs> okay. It's superficial. It's just going to come all crashing down one day. And Have you eaten Popeye's you fried chicken? That is far from superficial. What you need to do, Trisha, is look deep inside of you and see where do you want to be as a human being down the road. Wait, 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 wait. There's some really good fucking music that jives with this. Hold on. I think this is what it's missing. Hold on. Hold on, hold on. No, I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna show you guys something. Hold on. I'm gonna I'm gonna find this. Let me um Let me f Hold on. This is like really key. It might take me a little second, okay? All right. 
but it'll work. It'll work. Hold on. You can't tell me this doesn't work with it. Listen. Wait, here it is, here it is. Listen. It's like the- sorry, I fucked the joke up. Holy shit! It works so well! Oh my god! <laughs> oh my fucking god! All you need is a persona. <laughs> it's just a persona. <laughs> oh no! Oh no! Looking good, Joker. Did you eat a fucking burger? <laughs> oh man! Oh my god! That come from so much violence. I want you to watch oh. the movie. Okay? Oh no, she's gonna play some fucked up clips from like... Okay, good. I thought she was just gonna show like a chicken being decapitated Dominion. in a factory farm. How you find it is you go to watchdominion.com. That's it. It's all one word. Watchdominion.com. Watchdominion.com. Are you trying to like fucking... Are you trying to like promote some shit to me? How much does this cost? Watch! Watch the movie, boys. I love these one, dude. This is like the same shit I see on fucking. Can I just okay? So can I just say for record, all right? As somebody that once was an animal, like I, I hunted meat for a while. All right, now I don't do it as much because you know life gets in the way and everything. But uh, I, you know, you can be a person that eats meat and be against factory farming, right? You know what I mean? Is that okay? Does that make any sense? You know you can be against factory farming and eat meat, right, vegan teacher? This goes for any vegan that has told me. You know how many vegans have come up and said, when I made the PETA video, some guy was like, Muda, why don't you eat Beyond Meat? Why don't you eat fake? Because Beyond Meat tastes like shit! Okay? All right, motherfucker? Oh, Muda, but Beyond Meat, it's like real meat. Okay, who fucking lied to you, okay? All right, motherfucker, have you eaten Beyond Burgers? Okay, Beyond Burgers do not taste good, okay? Beyond Burgers aren't even good for you in the fucking first place, all right? Motherfucker, they are loaded in salt. They are loaded in fucking goop. I would rather eat an actual animal. But that's not sustainable. That's true. But you know what Beyond Meat is? You pay more for fake meat that doesn't even taste close to fucking real meat. I hate the ads for Beyond Meat. It's, you probably can't tell the difference between this and a real burger. Yeah, if I didn't have fucking taste buds. Okay, if I didn't have taste buds, maybe I'd do that. All right, motherfucker. If I if I needed Beyond Meat, I just eat vegetables, which I do anyways, because vegetables have more taste than a fucking Beyond Burger. It's like what the? I can't wait for Beyond Filet Mignon. <laughs> My ass, dude! I ain't paying extra for that bullshit. Get out of here. Com. Type it in. Watchdominion.com. I'm saying it She's like, sense. yeah, do you under- it's like, you know I don't like factory farming? That's why I pay more for meat, so it comes from like actual local farmhouses, so you pay a little bit extra. Yeah, that's what I do. I do that, alright? That's something I do. You know what I mean? You wanna know why I do it? Because humans have the choice of eating meat or vegetables. You don't have to stop- Motherfucker, that's the cycle of life itself. Alright, you don't have to torture the animal the entire life. I don't agree with that. All right, but when I hunted animals, dude, it was a clean fucking shot, quick death. That's what it is. All right, that's what it comes down to. These people make it out like there's a moral problem with them, like somebody is psychotic. We have been doing this shit since the caveman era. Nothing's going to change. Have I done P90X? Well, no. There's not like some army shit, dude. Like, I'm going to eat meat until I'm dead. All right, like, I'm going to eat meat. Or it's like, but you know you could live till like 99 if you ate a vegan. I don't care about living till 99, dude. 
All right, I just like to live a good life. And I like steak. You know what I mean? I like steak and potatoes. You know what I mean? You know, you know the biggest sadness I've ever had because of COVID-19 is not going out to have a good steak. I treat myself every month to a good steak dinner. I've not been able to do that. Because of this fucking pandemic. You're not going to take this shit away from me. Stop it. And I want you to watch the whole thing. I want you to bring a big box of Kleenex because it'll probably make you cry. Unless you have a heart of stone. And I really don't think that you do. Yeah, of course I'm going to cry, dude. They throw chicks into fucking meat grinders. All right. Yeah, no shit. It's going to, it sucks. To, that's why you don't change. support it. You can still be a meat eater. Everybody Your mountain messages will be public. Everybody will start caring about the animals. And this is how we will change the Thank world Thank you, Jerry. For the Thank you, Goldzior. The oceans need to be cleaned up. We need to get the garbage out of there that the poor whales are, are being forced to eat. We have to clean the skies, the air. We need to reduce our greenhouse gases. All of these things have to do with the way that we treat the environment, with the packaging that comes from places. Okay, so I'm going to say it right now. You know you can be all about green earth and shit and still be a meat eater. This isn't a vegan related issue. This is just, you're literally talking about factories. Factories are shit in a lot of fucking industries. It's not just the meat industry, okay? The meat industry is bad, but does she have any fucking idea how bad like other factory systems are? Like, what the fuck? <laughs> I don't get it. I don't understand it. So fucking weird. Like, That's it's, enough of the Trisha Paytas, okay? I get it. I understand you're preaching to me. That's really cool and all. Uh, let me go around and see what else we've got. Banned from TikTok for nudity and sexual activity. Well, you can't just share your snatch on the internet, man. All right? There's other websites for that. My bacon video was banned from TikTok. Who would you rather have sex with? All right, let's see. So I asked my husband... Who would you rather have sex with? That vegan nurse, that meat teacher, Ms. Tofu, or me? And his response was... What's the funny? What was the funny there? What was the funny? <laughs> what the fuck? Um, sure. God bless. God bless, dude. <laughs> she, uh... She, uh... I'm sorry, hold on. I need to, like, process. Hold that was a lot of... That was a lot of cringe right now. That was, uh, that was like a tactical nuclear device of cringe. That was like an IED of cringe, you know what I mean? Might as well, dude. That's, oh, like, that's, that's the level of fucking cringe. That was, like, way too much. Trying to process it. Why? <laughs> Why? <laughs> Alright, it's fine though. It's fine though. A lot of that story was just Black Ops 2, so. I played Black Ops 2 recently. You could probably understand. Queer Kiwi is not a real vegan? Oh sh oh sh oh shit! Yo bro, she throws him out. She's got like the she's got the fucking <laughs> She's got the MacBook Air out now. Oh shit. <laughs> A vegan teacher ain't fucking around. She's got Apple on her side. Oh, fuck. Let me tell you something. <laughs> Vegans like the environment. But did, did did anyone ever tell her? Did anyone ever did anyone ever tell her not to overspend on a laptop? Oh, she did. Hello, students. It seems Beyond Meat isn't that bad. Oh, it's pretty bad. Her name is The Queer Kiwi. And Wait, what? Greetings, guys, gals, and non-binary pals. Oh, that's actually a fucking... That's a, that's a, that goes well. That goes well. I, I gotta give her wordplay credit there. To respond to her, and so that's what I'm going to do. The title of her presentation is "The Vegan Teacher." That vegan teacher is not a. Re I fucking hate this. I, f I I'm sorry, guys. I'm I know that I'm stopping, but like, a real can I just say that I hate this beyond fucking belief? Every time I see this on somebody's laptop, I just leave. Like I just leave. I'm done. Like I don't do this shit. I don't fuck around with the sticker nonsense on the laptop, you know what I mean? Alright, you wanna know what my fucking laptop looks like? I'm gonna show you guys real quick. It's like a normal human being laptop, you know what I mean? Like, you know how it's like fucking clean and shit? Alright? Like, there's there's no fucking, there's no, there's no, there's no dumb little fucking stickers on it. Like, God fucking intended. Alright, you can even see inside, there's no fucking, like, there's, there's none of that shit. Alright, this is what a laptop is supposed to look like, you know? This is what a lap- this is a clean laptop. Damn, dude. Vegans. Scary. 
Scary. Is it RTX? Yeah. By the way, check these out. If you ever want to get some free stickers from PETA, you can get them and put them... Oh, PETA, the organization the that has been... Oh, That's the... PETA, People for the Ethical okay. Treatment of Animals. And I'm sure they are. You go to PETA.org for those. All right. Um, so... Right off the bat, I just want to talk about... Is she racist? She's she not racist. Her. What are you talking point, about? Uh, no, she's end, not. She says that I am sexist, homophobic, and racist. Even though I was literally wearing shirts that said that I was against homophobia and that I was um, against racism, for some odd reason she said these at the end. Now, I know that these are some bizarre rumors that are going around, and it's almost like she forgot everything that she said in her speech and then just decided to randomly put that in a conclusion. So... And that was just another bizarre thing. I mean, what? Okay, she said she's like anti-racist. Let's I have see been this. Vegan uh, for since June twenty seventh. Why does she look like she looked like a burnout? Vegan phobia. She's a, she's a little. Bull. Bomb, I don't know. I'll review my laptop if you guys um, want me to I've energize. Been a feminist and fighting for women's rights since. Um, okay. Do I have shares of GME? Yes, I've sold out of all my GME stuff though. I'm fifty six years old. And uh, I've also been fighting for the home, uh, the rights for the, the LGBTQ community. I was one person here in Canada who was fighting for their right to be able to marry. I am. A well, I'm glad you are. Most Canadians, you know, do that sh shit. She's making herself seem like she's fucking like the, the craziest person. I, I hate these. I hate, I hate this kind of stuff. Like, I'm glad that you fought for, you know, LGBTQ rights and everything. But it's like, at the end of the day, I think most people, it's just like, that's just a given. You probably should, man. Those people deserve, everyone deserves to be treated fairly and equally. You're not like God's gift to the fucking world for supporting something that is already, you know, just there anyways, right? It's like, it's like when there's people in the chat who are like, Muda, what do you think about gay people or trans rights? What do you mean I think about it? I think everyone deserves equal rights. What the fuck? Well, what do you think my answer was going to be? All right. What do you think my answer was going to be? What? You don't, you, you're not like me. You don't, you don't deserve the same right. What the fuck? You think I care? Live your life the way you want to live it, brother. Have you have a, have fun. What the fuck? All right. God damn. Life is too short for you to be, for somebody to oppress you. What the fuck, man? Do you think I give a shit? you think I care? Fuck that. I want everyone to be happy, baby. I'm a bisexual. I'm part of this community. And yet, apparently, somehow through all that, I'm also homophobic. It's the strangest thing. Racist. Apparently, I'm... Wait, did she say she's bisexual? I mean, I sucked a dick in college every once in a while, but I wouldn't say that I'm on, you know, fully there, but shit. Racist. Close. Even though I fight for the rights of dark-skinned people of all different shades constantly and think that they... I fought for everyone of all different shades. Goddamn. <laughs> Goddamn. I love saying stuff like that. Everyone's like, pause. <laughs> pause. I okay. should have a right to all of the rights that anybody else does and that they should not be discriminated against. They should have equal wages, equal access to jobs, be treated fairly. And okay, can you just, can you tell her why she's not a real vegan? You say that somebody who is on their way to transitioning, such as, for example, that they are really cutting down on, on the meat or the dairy or the eggs in their diet with the end goal of being vegan as soon as possible, you can say that. And that's okay. Okay, I'm just going to say it like it is. These kind of vegans are like fucking Linux users, man. Like militant Linux users. They'll never shut the fuck up about what operating system they use. They're like, yeah, I installed Gen 2 Linux. I'm basically God's gift to the fucking world. Bro, you know what? I can be really drunk right now.